Kudas are working, they are doing their job, packing the refuge, all those things, cleaning up every, even those ones that have been sweeping. Is that enough reason for her to empty her waste on a field compactor bin? Think about that for a moment and ask yourself how many other residents will do the same to these other bins across the metropolis? Obviously numerous. Come they come they pack this thing every day. They don't know what to make. Come and they come pack this thing every day, every day. They don't know what, what is going on. Some areas in the city of Calabar are very clean and attractive, no doubt. Here, the street cleaners and truck operators are seen doing their bit in most parts of the city. have much on the ground if the truck have problem. That's the only problem. That's the only reason we used to see depth. But if any time that the truck has no problem, the town will be clean every day because we do the work every day. A visit to the Cross River State Waste Management Agency reveals that the organization has its premises filled with damaged compactor beans, plus a shortage in equipment and personnel for field work. For us to have optimum results in this town, we need a minimum of nine trucks a day. We deploy six in the morning, three in the evening. But it fluctuates, as of today, it fluctuates between two trucks and five. That is totally, grossly inadequate to carry the waste from the fixed location. For the government, it is a passing phase that should not be allowed to take off the shine from the beautiful city. In perfection here, but we are on top of the situation and we are doing everything to cure such um, uh, challenges. You know, for instance, that this is the rainy season. And uh, because it is so, there are times when you have uh, rainfall on season for a couple of days. Uh, in situations like that, you have um, solid waste appearing from corners that you did not even expect. And it makes the job doubly difficult for those who do the evacuation. Um, you also have okay, times when there could be a breakdown, you know, unanticipated breakdown of equipment. You know, it creates some of these uh, very irregular situations that you find, you know. But um, it doesn't take us two, three days uh, to tidy up and get back to status quo. We are very committed to our hygiene. We believe that our tourism cannot you know, but operate in an environment that is healthy and clean. And being the preeminent tourist destination in this country. I bet many would hold on to those words from the commissioner. But more importantly, would expect residents to play their part in cultivating environmentally friendly and hygienic practices in waste disposal.